me off when people take ages to explain something that could be done in five seconds. So I'm going to explain everything that I've learned for steps for fixing Black Ops, um, but I'm not going to explain how it works. I'm going to put that in the description for you to read if you want to know how every step um, helps you get your Black Ops from stop having fatal errors or freezing. First step we're going to do is from my old video. So we go File, This PC, Local Disk C, Program Files. We basically just find where your um, Call of Duty Black Ops is held. You find these three applications. Um, all of them, you want to go Properties, Compatibility, Runners Administrator. You do the same for all of them. So Compatibility Administrator, Compatibility Administrator. Uh, that's the first step. Second step, go to Control Panel, go System and Security, go System. Once system opens, go to System Protection, Advanced, Settings, uh, the top one. Um, then you go to Advanced again on when the Performance Options opens, then go to Change on here. This will let, allow you to allocate RAM to certain drives. Um, you want to turn off automatically manage, select the drive you want, custom size, and then you can, like, you want to do this for the drive that you have Black Ops stored on, so you can have the maximum amount of RAM going to it. Um, it just gives you a lot more control. Uh, I'm, I'm going to cancel because it asks me to restart if I do, and I don't want to restart my computer. Uh, the next two steps are going to be firewall. So you want to go to right click uh, Windows Defender, uh, Virus Threat and Protection, um, Virus Threat and Protection Settings. And then you want to go down to exclusion. So you want to exclude something from the firewall. Um, you want to exclude your game from the firewall. So you can do both um, Battle.net or Call of Duty Black Ops 4. Try them, see which one works. Uh, I'm going to add both, just so you can see that me actually adding both of them. Just for the sake of it. Okay, cool. And then that's pretty much done. The next one you want to do, firewall and network protection. Allow an app for a firewall. Obviously, just fucking let... Black Ops 4 through the firewall. And that's all the steps that I've found so far. If you guys are still having issues, please let me know because I would like to solve what is happening with other people. Um, another problem that's happening with Black Ops is memory leaks. Memory leaks is where um, the game uses RAM and then when it's not using the RAM, doesn't get rid of it. So the data stores up on the RAM until it's like flooded with memory and then it just crashes the game because it doesn't have anywhere to go. Um, this is a problem that is very hard to fix. The only way that you can fix it is by closing the application. Um, it's something that I believe the devs are working on at the moment, and there's not really much you can do at the moment for it. So apologies uh, if that wasn't much help, but I hopefully I helped solve some of your solutions. All right, guys, uh, if you have any more problems, comment, and I'll try and sort you out.